Hey everybody and welcome to Married with Media. We are here today for another theater vlogging experience. And uh, yeah, we're right outside of the theater. What are we seeing tonight? We are seeing Zola. Zola, an A24 film starring yep. Riley Keough and um, I don't know who else. Uh, there's another girl in it, but I don't know her name. But um, yeah, I'm a big fan of the A24 films. Uh, a lot of them are uh, very weird very strange experiences yeah. often but um they're always interesting so yeah i'm excited to check this one out it, it could be worse we could be going to see the hitman's wife's bodyguard <laughs> guard or something uh or fast yeah. nine or, or whatever not, everybody else has seen those. uh but yeah we're going to go see a weird movie about strippers going to florida so what, should be fun what better movie to see together as husband and wife <laughs> <laughs> there you go so uh are you ready to head in yeah i'm excited um I, I think that I'm expecting it to be, like, okay. I think if, if at best we can hope for is okay, then that's okay with me. So, yeah, we'll see. <laughs> All right. Are you ready for Zulu? I mean, Zola? What's yeah. it called? Is that right? Zola. Nobody in here? Empty theater all to ourselves. Guess nobody wants to see Zolo. We are um, a little early, though. Yeah. Got to be early, front row seat. Well, second to back row seat. All right, so we just got out of the theater scene, Zola. Um, I, I, this is an interesting one. What do you think about it? I'm going to let you go first. Yeah, so this movie was very funny. <laughs> <laughs> I laughed a ton. I don't know if they wanted us to. <laughs> I think uh, there's definitely definitely intentional humor in there. Right. Um, I don't know her name. Uh, not Zola, but the other girl. Riley Keough. Yeah. She, her character was, she was so good at playing uh, a prostitute, basically. <laughs> yeah. And with this uh, very urban accent. Um, that, yeah, uh, spot on. Yeah, she was fantastic in the movie. I, I thought she was great. Right. And I mean, the girl who played Zola was good too, but... Yeah, everybody in the movie was good. Um, it, it's an interesting movie. It has a, a very distinct style to it. I, I like some of the filmmaking qualities to it. I thought it had some, yeah. some nice shots and a, a cool aesthetic. Um, and For, the, the musical cues also, like there's this harp that kind of, yeah. which it plays in the trailer, but there's this harp that kind of, uh, goes through it. It has like this kind of almost dreamlike, uh, quality yeah. to it when you're watching it. Yeah. Um, I, I mean, I really don't know how I feel. It's not a movie that like I loved or anything. Right. I don't know if I'll ever watch it again. Yeah. Um, the whole time we're watching it and there's some very awkward scenes in the movie um, I'm thinking about how, like, I even said it to you, there's families, like, two theaters over watching <laughs> Boss Baby and Peter right. Rabbit 2, and we're in here watching this, like, uh, strippers grind on poles, and right. uh, guys pull down their pants in full frontal male nudity, Right. and yeah, it's it's that kind of movie, so, yeah, for sure. um, but yeah, I mean, I liked it, it's a good movie, I think. Yeah, I, I didn't hate it, um, like I said, I think, like... The almost like outrageousness, <laughs> or like yeah. I don't know. It. I think that that is like what made me like it. Um, yeah, I don't know. It was. It was funny. <laughs> it, it's it. Yeah, it was funny. It was funny. I, there was moments. Uh, um, because they also like have and not this, in like that typical. You know, they do the whole thing funny, where like but... they. It's basically like them both narrating like what's right. going on because the movie's based on like a twitter thread that was in 2015 it even says that at the beginning of the movie um so they're doing like the narration from both of their perspectives um and kind of they show it from riley keogh's perspective which i don't even know her name in the movie um and then zola's perspective and yeah everybody's great in the movie i like the a lot of the comedy came from the guy from succession too yeah uh greg i think is his name on the show i don't know what his name was in the movie was it greg in the movie I feel like it was Greg in the movie. <laughs> I can't remember. But a lot of the comedy came from him as well. And uh, the one guy, the, the pimp, um, right. was really good at, at his character, too. There, I mean, there's some twists and turns in this movie. Yeah. Um, and it, it tur actually turned into a, I'd say in the last 30 minutes, a pretty decent uh, crime thriller, almost. Mm -hmm. um, so it's not just, like, strippers and weird stuff. Um, it actually, there's a story to it, and I think it goes... Right. Um, goes in some interesting places. And yeah, overall, I think it's a good movie. 
Yeah, um, I didn't hate it. Um, I didn't love it, but like it was, it was good. Yeah, that's our that's our first reaction. We might talk about it a little bit more if we do another live stream or something like Sunday or Monday or one of those days and talk about like multiple movies, like kind of like we did this past Monday. So we might go a little bit more in depth um, in the movie. But yeah, that's our thoughts. Yeah. Um, and we appreciate you watching. Please, if you haven't yet subscribed to Mary with Media. Hit the subscribe button. Also, like this video and comment down below if you've seen Zola. Yes. What are your thoughts? Are you going to see it? Comment down below. Turn on those bell notifications for all future videos. And we'll see you next time.